It's hard to believe that this oasis of calm in the heart of a bustling, overcrowded city with its green lawns, towering trees, flowering shrubs, and the distant chanting of Buddhist nuns is the Jewish cemetery in Hong Kong. Now surrounded by high-rise, it was first established in 1855 by David Sassoon and his family and expanded in 1904 by Hong Kong's only Jewish governor, Sir Matthew Nathan. Our cemetery is one of the very few Jewish cemeteries in the Far East that remains today in its original 19th century location, and it serves as the final resting place for 375 members of our community who made Hong Kong their home. The cemetery's earliest burials were predominantly community members originally hailing from Baghdad, many of them via India, and the oldest graves are the simple granite sarcophagi that are seen behind the cemetery's chapel. As the community grew and prospered and its demographics changed, so too did the gravestones with the variety of styles and different materials that can be seen throughout the cemetery today. The inscriptions in a multitude of languages also bear witness to the community's diversity. There's very little biographical detail on the majority of the stones, so we're left with a tantalizing peep into the past, but with so many questions left unanswered. We know who they were, but where did they come from? Who were their families? And what was it that brought them to Hong Kong? The Jewish Historical Society has been researching the lives of these people, so if you're related or you know someone who is able to send us any information for our files, we'd welcome it if you could be in touch with us.